hard to breathe, but that's alright. Hush. Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm in place here, bringing you guys the first ever Minecraft video on this channel. In today's video, we are going to be checking out five secret things you didn't know you could build in your very own Minecraft world. Now this works for each and every platform you play on, whether it's Bedrock, Java, PlayStation, Xbox, or even Nintendo Switch. Guys, according to the YouTube analytics, only a small percentage of you guys who watch my videos are actually subscribed. So if you end up enjoying the video, consider subscribing, it's free. And guys, let's have a deal. If you guys learn at least one new thing in today's video, you guys have to drop a like in today's video. Other than that, let's get straight into the video with build number one. Okay, so guys, for build number one, we are going to be making an awesome dining table. Now, I've seen many people build dining tables, but those dining tables are a little boring. For making this awesome dining table, you're going to need 10 dark oak trapdoor, 4 spruce wood stairs, 3 item frames and any food of your choice. Personally, I like a cake, apple, a cooked beef and cooked chicken. Okay, so guys, the first thing we need is a house, a floor and a wall because just imagine building a dining table in the middle of nowhere. So for that, I personally like to have white concrete as my walls and birch planks as my floor. So let me just make that real quick. Alright guys, now let's start with building the dining table. So first you need the legs. So what you want to do is take this dark oak trapdoor, come to the wall here, place it like this, here, and open it up so that it goes that way. Do the same thing here with three blocks difference, one, two, three, and put two more trapdoors and open it up like this. Now you got to crouch and place another trapdoor on the same level of this trapdoor, not above it. So like this, do like this. And just fill it out. And for a table, you need chairs. Chairs are very important. So just place one here, one here, one here, and another one here. Now is the food because a dining table should always have food. So take item frames. Oopsie. You should not do that. Uh, 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 oh, right here. Crouch and place three item frames like this. And here, place a cake. Look at that yummy, delicious cake. Then keep this apple here. Stand and keep this apple. Cook beef and cook chicken. And voila, guys, you have a very cool dining table. Now, I like this because the table looks like chocolate bars. And you know, you have food around with a nice, you know, wall, floor and all that. So guys, that was build number one. Now let's go to build number two. All right, guys, for build number two, we are going to be making a TV stand. Who doesn't like a lovely TV stand? So for building this TV stand, there are two faces. As you can see, the first line is the first face and this line is the second face. So for the first phase, you're going to be needing a single cobblestone wall, some, some blocks of redstone, I don't know how much, it depends. Two pistons, two redstone torches, two enchantment table, two wither skeleton skull and two armor stamps. So for building this also, you need a nice wall and a floor. So I'm just going to build it here. Okay, so guys, for building this, just go towards the wall, break these two here next to the wall and place two enchantment tables. Come one step front, break this, these two blocks, two blocks down 
and place two redstone torches here. Now you guys might be wondering, huh? For this TV stand, why do you need enchantment tables and redstone torches? You guys will know in a minute. So next, break this wall here like this and behind it you want to place two armor stands now remember that these two armor stands have to be straight so keep it like this and like this then you have to crouch and change their pose to this standing pose for both of them then take the wither skeleton skull and equip both of them now this looks terrifying but wait next what you have to do is place a cobblestone wall here take a piston place it here oh oopsie um, I'm just gonna fill that like this place it here take take any activation block I'm taking block of redstone and place it here boom it goes like this now break these two and the cobblestone why why yes great what I want to do now is place these pistons here and activate it with redstone like this so as you can see this is not in a perfect line here it should be like this next what you want to do is take take a piston and place it on the right side right side of like this right side the first armor stand so place it like this uh why every time place it like this place a dub place a double piston like this then take the restroom block activate this first then activate this and now as you can see the armor stands with the wizard skulls are on the enchantment table uh, and one more thing before you do all this take the floor and cover this up you know i forgot that yeah next what you want to do is place any two blocks here i just have birch planks birch plank, so i am keeping it here but you can put any block then you have to take the piston and place it here every single time i every time misplace the mining button and the placing button next i have to put it like this take the activation block and boom this is what happens now as you can see the armor stands is perfectly here now you can take your walls and cover this up because you don't want to see a tv stand with the background of a plain flat land so what you want to do is cover this up voila it should look like this now this is for the first phase now for the second phase you're going to be needing these items you need four smooth stone slabs two levers two strip birch log two a single stone button four pistons some block of redstone or any activation material and two iron trap doors now what you want to do is go to your tv take your smooth stone slab place it right here four of them right here like this and then take your strip birch log place two here and then just build one two three and just break these two blocks go down put a piston here this you have to put a double piston so down like this down uh, no not like this like this and the same thing like this and now break this block now take your block of redstone why i every time misplace this put the piston take a block of redstone activate the top layer first not this not this top, top layer first then activate the bottom layer and break this thing and voila guys as you can see this is like a black screen the black screen of the tv now if you remember i told the armor stands should be straight if the armor stands were not straight in a line then you would see a little crook here which let's be real who wants a crack on the tv next take your stone button place it here so it's like your button of pressing on and off the tv jump up here take your lever place Two levers like this no not like this like this so as you can see this kind of looks like a tv not the now tv an old tv now you guys might be wondering huh why does he have iron trapdoors so what you want to do now is place two iron trapdoors here 
take the floor oh i don't have the floor let me search it back yes here it is take the floor break this floor right here now you guys might be wondering why am i breaking stuff again and again and now you guys might be thinking why is the redstone torch down there now what you're gonna do is cover this up like this clean uh wait one second um no you do not want iron trapdoor like this uh one minute okay put like this break this oh let me go get back an, an enchantment table all right guys i brought back the enchantment table and it's going right back now what you want to do is take these and again crouch and place them yeah the iron trapdoor should go up again like that you can see no why this is so wrong what you want to do is now take an, an iron trapdoor straight to the tv and then place it then break this block again then go crouch place this and voila guys you have a brand new tv set this looks cool right so guys that is it for build number two now let's get on to build number three all right guys for build number three we're gonna be doing a nice chest of drawers i mean you won't be needing a chest of drawers but looks cool so for making the chest of drawers you're going to be needing four item frames four anvils two oak trapdoors four spru spruce trapdoors four sp two spruce wood slabs and two spruce wood planks so after taking all these yeah you, you want to go to your like a home and again fill out a house because you don't want a dressing table right in the middle of nowhere so what you want to do is build a floor and a wall i'm just gonna make it like um all right guys for building this chest of drawers first you're gonna be play you're gonna be placing three wood planks three spruce wood planks in uh, l shape like this and then take your wood slabs and put it like no not like this like this uh, yeah like this would be better and then what you want to do is take your spruce trap doors and place them like this yes just like this so that they close like that and the same thing on the other side no not like yeah like that is okay yes perfect just like that then you want to jump up take your oak trap doors and do the same thing and you want to keep this not here oh sorry you have to keep it right there so now it's like i'm pulling this particular drawer and wait one more thing you can see in the background it's white so what you want to do is break that go behind place and place a spruce wood plank so that it feels you know nice it's like a part of the drawer next what you want to do is take your item frames and place them all around here like this even on the slab now what you want to do is place no not that uncrouch and place the anvils inside so now as you can see this this looks like a you know a handle to pull out the drawers particularly i like this chest of drawers because you know it's cool it looks cool it's modern and all that okay guys that's gonna be for bill number three let's move on to bill number four all right guys for bill number four we're gonna be doing a nice you know i don't know what it's called it's like a bed with drapes it but it looks amazing so what you want to need is yes eight beds now i like the color red and you know red beds are like the og color in minecraft so what you want to do now is take eight beds you can see one two three four five six seven eight take 60 dark oak trap doors 
and how much is this 24 red banners 36 red carpet 32 spruce fence and four wool four white wool and four oak signs so for this i'm not going to be building like a floor and a wall i'm just going to do it normally so what you want to do is take these beds place them like this four in one line go here place them like this again now i have a lot of beds so i'm clearing all this except this i i have to keep it so go woof now what you want to do is take all of these uh, come on come on yes and then take your oak signs crouch and just place it like this just a simple oak sign uh, no don't open no break up yes like this yeah just like that and then you want to take your white wool and just place it here like you know a nice pillow and as you can see this is um what's going on here actually oh my god guys i did this completely wrong give me a minute okay guys so you're gonna want to put the bed like no not like that no 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 what the hell is going on here? why i every time misplace the mining button and the placing button so what you want to do is take your bed and keep it like this yes you have to keep it like this oh no 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 not here like this the white part the pillows are going to be on the side on the opposite side now what now what you want to do is take your own oak sign and place it here just a simple oak sign right here like this and then you know you have to keep the white wool as the pillow now what you want to do is take your spruce fence place one here here next to the pillow on both sides no not that. here and build this to four blocks high one two three no 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 three and four four yeah four is enough so build that on all sides I might be a little slow because I am playing with the controller on a phone so this is kind of tough now what you want to do is come on come on come on yes now what you want to do is connect all these fence together with more oak fence with more spruce fence Now what you want to do is jump on top, jump on top and take these dark oak trap doors and place them like this. No, not there. Next to it. Do not place it on top of the fence, but it should be on the same level as the fence. And just fill this. No, not like that. And just fill the whole space with these. And voila guys, I placed all these here. <laughs> this took a long time. Now what you want to do is take your red carpet and place them again same on top of all these and also on top of the fence. And voila guys as you can see we have a nice red carpet on here so now it looks good from the outside and as you go inside you're like wow it's red and you know chocolate on top of you that's great now for the last part and the most good part is the drape so what you want to do is place two like this one here one two block difference one here and two here as you can see no 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 not here on this no 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 not here yes right here so as you can see this looks good 
Now you just have to do that on all the four sides. So that is it guys for build number four. This looks extremely good. Just imagine getting up and seeing this on top of you. This just looks crazy. So guys, that's going to be it for build number four. Let's go on to the last build of today's video, build number five. All right, guys, for the last build of today's video, this is something I really like. It's a nice modern fireplace. Who doesn't like a warm fireplace in the house? So what you want, what you need is a single piece of netherrack, finished steel, of course, to light it, 15 stone bricks, 11 smooth stone slabs, six gray stained glass panes, and three gray carpet. Now, of course, you need a fireplace in your house. So what you want to do is, um, no, not here. Yes, take your floor and uh, wall. Of course, I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna be keeping the same color throughout th throughout the video. So now, what you wanna do is take your floor and just place it. All right, guys, for building this fireplace, you're going to be placing two stone bricks here with one block difference and here like this. Break this on the floor and place your nether rack. Now take your fender seal and light it. Boom. But first, what you want to do is break these six blocks because let's be honest, you don't want your house to be burned on fire. So what you want to do is place these smooth stone, sla smooth stone slabs on the top of like this just perfect like this so now as you can see this will not spread over your house and create a mayhem next what you want to do is take these smooth stone slabs place it right like this yes like this place one down here and as you can see this is good but now we need to make a chimney so go up here destroy these three here place like this And voila guys, as you can see, we have a big chimney. But of course, you need to keep the fire away from you. So what you want to do is take your take the grey stained glass pane and just enclose the fire with this, like this. Yes, then take the grey carpet and place it on top of the glass. And voila guys, as you can see, we have built a beautiful fireplace. And of course, it won't burn your whole house. And guys, that's gonna wrap up today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Now, if you knew all five builds, then you're just amazing because I tried a lot. It's been like three, four days since building all of these and trying out for you guys. And guys, the best part of all these builds are you can build all of these without mods and add-ons. This can be done in your vanilla Minecraft world. And guys, if you really like all 5 of these builds, comment down below from a scale of 1 to 10 on how good all of these look. And that's gonna wrap it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, smash the like button down below, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Share this video to your friends, comment down below what type of games you want me to play next or, or videos in general. And other than that, it's been Aman. Have a wonderful and safe day everyone and I'm out. Peace.